Well, hello everybody, Heroes of the Greeks here with part 6, I think, no, 64 of the uh, Caesar and Gold campaign, or at least the uh, Historical Rome campaign. Thank you for joining me today again. And again, I want you to uh, go, go take a look down the link below and hopefully help me choose the next faction. Uh, of course, where we left off is that we were um, building up, of course, an, uh, some armies. We built actually already up the armies and we defeated quite a large... Um, a battle in this vicinity against quite a, law, a, la, a large or force of Setones, and uh, we also made peace with quite a lot of factions to make our war state a little bit precarious. Of course, we were at war quite a lot of factions, and we're more or less getting a bit better in that regard because no longer fighting the Trabali over here, neither the Averni tribe. We're still fighting the uh, Nerva tribe, and um, a few factions that are not too big or something like that so they're not the most problems like the randoms or less also fighting us maybe they want peace with us i don't know we're definitely now right now definitely the strongest faction as you can see most of our balance bar is in uh, our favor and of course i would not mind just going to peace with some of these factions yeah sure 700 for peace treaty is uh, definitely agreeable um are there factions oh these guys might hate me now because i made peace with them ah well not so much i suppose uh these guys are not fighting we're fighting the Setone still of course that's that's not going to end we made a mistake before and that didn't end well we, we allowed them to leave, but they stabbed me in the back, more or less. So, yeah. Never trash the ghouls, never trust the barbarians, the honor their words. I suppose you can also not say that from the Romans, <laughs> necessarily. Uh, let's send uh, Caesar over here to help out with replenishment. But for, I don't think we actually got anything left. At least, maybe a little, I'm not too sure. We just have to make sure that we can replenish. And this year as well, we're still starving, so we'll have that problem at the moment. So hopefully over time I can like make sure that that uh, is uh, stopping. So right now we're just going to be replenishing a little bit, I suppose, building up, and hopefully we can attack, of course, the Setones very soon. Although we possibly could do this already if you maybe combine the troops um, from uh, from this guy's army and after them. And I think we just should do it to make sure that we have enough. And maybe if we can send in the Carnates against them as well, that would be great. That would just really be helpful. So let's try and see if we can buy them into going to war with the uh, what is it, Setones? Join war against the Setones? Alright, um, join war. No, I won't. I won't. More. And join the war against Estonia. Is that okay? Not! No! No, no, no. Ah, damn it. Okay, so that won't work. Uh, this means you're supposed to have to go and uh, hold this for the moment. So I guess hopefully it is enough. Oh, okay, good. Yeah, we're just going to our to make sure that the Estonians are dead. I don't think we lost any units. No, we, yeah, we lost one legionary unit. That's unfortunate, but I guess. For now, we're going to have to uh, leave it at that. Let's go and sack it, of course. And I'll... Ah, you kidding. Why are they just not dead? Because they're not going to bring in, like, an entire army full of mercenaries or something like that. This is going to happen because there's something to do that all the time. But it's quite annoying, if you must ask me. But, alright. And I think it also allows me to go and trade with the Carnates, don't it? Yeah, okay, that's great. That's not bad. Now they won't mind to join me against fighting the Nervi. Ooh. Th those two? Oh, perfect. Also, some, f also some money for that deal. Because we got quite a lot of like uh, stuff for trade, so... As you can see, we get quite a lot of that from it. We may even ask for even more money. Perfect! Ah, well. Would have loved to do that a second ago. Perfect, and now signing then as well. Alright, uh, can these, would these guys be able, what, bidding to trade with me? I would ex no, 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 hold your mouth, thank you, nope, and another faction, the Bello, the Fossi, or Bello, Bello Vasky, anyway, we uh, made a dear trade trade right now, and uh, we're doing reasonable, I guess, ah, the Setonis, okay, let's go over here, because I really don't want them to come, 
Ah, that's unfortunate. Any more uh, spies nearby? Yes, we do. We've actually got one over here, funny enough. So let's try and uh, supplant with the supplies. Did it work? It wounded even. Hmm. And we got her, who's not as good. So I suppose we're going to have to look. So right now we more or less have uh, advanced into our own ter uh, these better territories. So I guess that's not too bad. Oh, I, I thought I built it up or not. Uh, let's convert it over. It's eight turns, nine turns even. Yeah, it takes such a long time. Come on, replenish already. Um, is it in other... Yeah, there's still Brigade, isn't it? I could send you back because we're no longer like fighting the Averni tribe. So I think what we could do is just yeah fall back a little, I guess. Because um, if you can like go back and to replenish also to move troops, I think that might be a good op a good option. And um, yeah, I think that's the better option because we're not longer at war with anybody in this in this vicinity. So I suppose we can hold on for that war for a moment. And I guess, yeah, they're quite un unhappy with us because we ended, of course, the war. How old is Caesar right now? Out of curiosity. I think he's quite old. Uh, 47, so I'm not sure how long we're now at, which, uh, how long we're in total years. Uh, there's 12 turns per year. So we're out 100 turns or something like that. I'm not too sure, but anyway, quite long, I guess. Like four or five years. Uh, uh, does anyone know how old Caesar starts off? Because then we know exactly how many years we're going right now. Ready for but um, are there any other things that we can like build up for the moment? I don't think so, right? Let's use this one for the moment. Oh. Well, anyway, let's send turn and see what happens, I guess. Um, it happened. The fr they, they again got a freaking army. They was fr bastards. Oh my god, those bastards, you, you got to be freaking kidding me, like, they, uh, they basically did this, like, a second ago, these guys just got this back, I think what happened is that, um, maybe the Nerva, like, sacked the city, and uh, they took it, like, back or something, hot to me, is absolutely insane, and I have to, I cannot fight, oh, what, already replenished, you got to be kidding me, hmm. Not bad, not bad. Um, I guess we're just getting another, uh, what is it, an archer unit. I don't mind that too much. But what we can do then is instead of having those two over here, we can send Caesar back to pull them back. And because they got such a long range, that is insane. <laughs> and uh, what I'm not going to do is get um, get them like in the same province because that won't work out. I guess because if you if we put them like in the settlement, there's a chance that they will siege them out. And we've got like three stacks right now, see here. So I'm surprised that they were able to replenish this quickly. Nicely done, Caesar. You replenished in almost one turn. Thank you very much. Okay, then, that's good. Lutheum. Oh, they like me now very much, I guess. <laughs> All right, this is interesting. Really having a stand up against the Nervi now. The thing also is, at some point, we're going to have that uh, event. I thought this is going to be absolutely annoying. Plot. Okay, your power is our influence in the name. People plotting against you in again in, in fear. <laughs> oh, good God! I just hope that doesn't happen. That would be great. Uh, how far are you, Anthony? You are in uh, starving still because you have absolutely no nothing, no supplies, I guess. Over here, they are building it up. So, uh, can we get like a mom? No, they're at their last legs, I guess. Um, does Anthony have like a yeah, he has one. The both you have one. No, you don't. So let's go and recruit one champion for him. Definitely that one. Okay then. Uh, this one always, and then one of those. Doesn't really matter too much. Anyway, let's go and turn. I guess.
there's not much else that we can do for the moment, so let's uh, see that you can, can try to bring him a bit further. It would be nice if you also could see how much the religion is. That's one thing you can actually like do in the uh, in the improved Dilla version, so I suppose that is definitely an improvement. Uh, well, we are back on our feet, I suppose, like we could say. We are getting in some sort of a situation that we are able to hold on. And for some reason, I have three unit recruitment over here, and I have no idea why that is. Like, zero. I don't mind it. I really don't, so... Quite interesting, I guess. We may want, maybe want to replace uh, one of these guys for uh, one of the horses. Because they're just better. <laughs> and uh, one of those actually can also go. Because I would love to give Caesar some better horses. Now well, let's uh, switch it up a little. What I might want to do is that get all these guys uh, like banned and get them. Are they much better? Uh, range is same. More range actually. I. That might also be because they're not yet recruited at all. Their armor value is definitely quite lower. And because we don't have any cosmic cost us any to recruit them, I suppose why not? And I don't know why, I don't mind it at all, but still, it's interesting. Is it because I have so many decreasements or something, or is it a bug? Uh, or is it because of the re research tech that we got in? Is that why uh, upkeep costs of armies decreased? Uh, no. That's five. Nope. Um, that's five percent. Uh, ah, okay, the auxiliary units is fifty percent for auxiliary units. Okay, that's fifty-five for auxiliary, not the other ones. And levy unit recruitment, like that's the normal one. So that's fifteen percent, and that's sixty-five for the uh, auxiliary. Um, okay, and then anywhere else? I don't make this thing fast area, do we? Yeah, non um mercenary recruitment, so that's that's twenty five that's seventy five percent for the one. So we're twenty five and uh, twenty five, so Oh, wait a second guys. Uh that was that. Uh there might be coming again the blip, but there's something for the recording session I'm going to do tonight, so apologies in advance. Um Uh okay. Anthony's going up here to uh getting some can he actually recruit? Um out of question. You can definitely remove Toe of these units, I don't think they're too much use in, for uh, this uh, engagement. Um, again, we can be, I suppose we can get some uh, spears. Why not? Yeah, these ones as well, also so low recruitment. Why is that? I have no idea why. It would be interesting to know. But well, I guess uh, for the moment, instead of fuller, uh, should we go for four? Yeah, let's go for four spears. Oh, yeah, there, got it again. But, uh, I will wait a second before we, uh, I get back into that. Uh, we're also going to uh, get all of these guys together. Alright, um, that's one, one of these units. So that's more than enough infantry. Then we also can get some extra calf. Well, let's get for the fun, let's also get a Numidian. So in two turns he will be done with recruiting and then he can go come down again. So that's perfect. So all the armies are being recruited. Um, there might be coming a big battle up, of course, as well against the Nervi. They got like four armies in the vicinity. That's going to be interesting to see how that will be panning out. So, uh, I suppose I will see you all in a second again when the turning has been done. So, turnings are getting quicker and quicker. <laughs> oh, these guys also well. Like, uh, can we get more? No, not really. We can get some mercenaries, I guess. Yeah, I have to keep. I have to keep the mirror, otherwise I'm not going to fight Britain. I'm just not going to do it. I'm not interested in that. That's also not part of course this campaign. Um, there's going to be an historical Rome campaign. I suppose the Caesar and Gold campaign 
I don't think it is really possible to do that historically because of how this went and I sort of, well I'm moving away from that but we're just going to go through the campaign again. I sort of did that in the beginning of the campaign was, uh, because then it was more possible. I suppose in the Octavian campaign we're just going to be really going to do an overall conquest campaign um, in that uh, I suppose. Um, if you understand exactly what I mean. That. So you guys are still recruiting I guess. Uh, at least replenishing so let's hope that uh, falls into place sooner than later uh, I'm so in I should just attack him right now don't I I'm here subdash I can't wouldn't for real my blood flows I might be able to attack him now. It doesn't. Yeah, I got get the recruitment of the town, but I suppose the town has been weakened by that attack quite a lot. So let's attack the city. Are you kidding? Hmm. I had hoped that we we wouldn't have to fight it, but I think we have to. I would love to love to be Caesar in charge, but I guess we can still do that. So let let's do that instead. I'd rather have Caesar in charge than someone else. And uh, we also can do with this army. Let him like, oh, I thought he could maybe raid still, but no. Caesar can do that afterwards. Oh, that makes actually quite a difference. So uh, let's uh, go into the battle, I guess. I want to battle in this episode at least. So I'll be back in a uh, see you can battle. Well, my uh, new laptop just came in, so <laughs> I'm sorry, guys, because I have to do some stuff uh, with that as well. So. Uh, also for school, but I will promise you we'll just finish this uh, this battle, I guess. And I'm not sure, so I will check that for a second. Depending on that, that depends how long we're going to go for after the battle. Hopefully the battle is quite long, because I think that costs well, like 6,000 against 5,000, so... Hey, why not, right? Um, So our analyze coming from this side. Oh, you got to be kidding. That is not bad. Basically behind the hill, so we're definitely going to try and take the hill. Because I think they will possibly try and attack that. I would even the experience. Oh, and five archer units. Perfect. Guess if we don't have so the siege engine, we go for the archers. Alright, let's start. Uh, we don't have to do much else. So, um... I'm not sure tomorrow or maybe yeah I think Friday or Thursday the, the release of the Hungary campaign well I think I might will be doing the editing on Thursday so I think I'll release it then on Friday I will give you times also guys some time to still vote for the new faction so I think oh I'm um, we were taking the hill right so I guess we'll try and still do that Alright, um, come over here. For now, let's come over here. Oh god. Oh well, they can just come over here, I guess. Um, let's also send out uh, these two guys to uh, scout the place, I guess. That is something we can do. Hopefully they will come after us. And um, I'm, I'm seeing uh, the enemy is starting to line up. Oh yeah. They are definitely doing that. Oh god. Alright, yeah, they're definitely, they're definitely lining up. Okay, that's good, that's fine. I don't mind that too much. Alright, so they're lining up. Um, you guys can keep in this the here boots here and you guys can come over here to try and scout this side of the map um, um, I'm also really curious to see how the laptop will be performing like with total war. I'm not sure it might be actually quite good too. Oh God, why are you not running? Now, you, now is the time to run actually. Uh, like, oh, there we got uh, some more uh, enemies. 
Oh god, no. Heart group again. A little bit more of a change up. Wait a second. Continue. Uh, sorry for the uh, interruption. You can just see, like, they they, they deploying the calf like here. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Actually, Dunderguard, this, this entire army actually can go back from where it was. Uh, this way. Everybody's getting into position. Not too bad. Divided Impera, the best mod for Rome 2, if you ask me. And one of the better mods of the Total War franchise, at least for me. I always enjoyed it quite a lot. Oh, it looks good. Just look at that. The dust cloud. The Caesar's Legion have come to subjugate the nervy once and for all. Are we going to attack him? Ah, oh, crap. Whoops. I was not paying attention to that. As you of course can see. Oh yeah, they are coming towards here. <laughs> and not too small numbers. That can be said. Um Oh um yeah like that. I guess that's more than big enough. <clears throat> I know I've got these guys like here on the flank and I've got uh use these ones right here to help out as well and this main cavalry was forward on this side can go up here in this general can again go up here so all right does that Nice! Oh. Legionary cavalry. Charge. Come up, kill them already. Okay, yeah, because we are getting close to their slinger units. Come up, kill him! Really? Are you kidding? Still? Alright. Um, pull back with the calf over here. Um, send these guys in to join because they're sort of... Okay, good. They're dead. Alright, fall over like this way, calf. Oh no, you just go into your own group then. Alright. Uh, Caesar, where are you? Get up here. Everybody getting into place? Because it seems like they are getting ready for an assault. Please over here. They're definitely waiting. They're getting onto line. I don't mind it too much. I definitely think we can hold the line as long as we can hold this hill. So 
That's great. As long as we can hold this hill, that would be something if we wouldn't. Hmm. Interesting. Oh well, at least this flank is quite well protected over here. We got some of those uh, heavy legionaries with full plate. I'm going to send them like over here to just keep scouting the area for the moment. So when the battle is going to commence, I will be, um, yeah, of course, starting the battle. Well, here we are in the battle. Um, yeah, as you can see, they are moving towards us, so I suppose that's not too bad. Um, I like lose. Yeah, I lost one of the calf units in that, in doing that. So yeah, fine. I don't mind it too much. They were, they were not good, like really good units. We can recruit them by back easily. Our hidden units have been discovered. What? So close. Ay ay ay. Units has used all its ammunition. Jupiter gives us strength. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Ready. All right, and it's oh god, Ooh. this entire group. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, yeah, get the information. Thank you. Ready. <clears throat> One of our units has used all its ammunition. Ay, ay, ay. Whoa. Hmm. Oh. One of our units has used all its ammunition. You go after them. You guys come over here. See what you can do behind the back lines. Although they are still have. The Setonis forces are still over here, so let's bring these cav over here to see what we can do with them from this side. I think that might be a bit more effective. All right, let's. Um, <clears throat> One of our units has used all its ammunition. Ooh. Ah, we just have to be careful a little bit that we don't like kill off all our calf. Ooh, you're still pursuing them. Oh yeah. Uh, well, we'll see who wins. <laughs> I must admit, I don't really mind it too much. The archers, like they pumped up kills though, so that's not too bad. Let's send in the general to see if he can uh, help out with that as well. Alright, let's uh, get the out of the formation. Units 
Fritz has used all its ammunition. Alright, let's send him all in. Um. We were never in trouble. Let's uh, send everybody into the into the gaps. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Oh. What? Ooh. Where are you going? All right. That's interesting. Um, yeah, definitely pursue them because they are still quite numerous, some of them. Alright, let's pu uh, pull them out. Well, well, we got these guys who can definitely hold that together for the moment. What on earth are they doing? Fine by me, I guess, but still weird. First them. Actually, you can go after them. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Ah well. Alright, you go after them. Ooh, yeah, them as well. Ah, oh, 82. 88, sorry. Um. Alright, F3 cavalry unit come back. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Keep fighting them. Keep 
pursuing. Oh, take him back. The battle is turning in our favor. Well, Arches, you are the only ones who are quick, so let's just come over here. Doesn't really matter too much. Damaged. We'll send you right over into here. You come over here to woods. I don't know where. Okay, I think that is most of them killed off. Over here, so we got a group, two groups actually. Are you kidding? Oh my! Damn it! Okay, that's annoying. Oh well, that is something I'm going to have to deal with on my own because it should... Ah, for real? Alright. Somewhere in this fight, the uh, Caesar, uh, the generals. Oh, did it? Re oh, that's. I suppose that's the. Oh, oh, that's the general from the, from the, from the garrison, I guess. All right, still annoying that we actually have to go and pursue that uh, general unit, but this definitely valued time a bit lost. So, uh, I suppose what I'm going to do now is I will try and go and do that. And I think we've won the battle now, more or less. Again, thank you for watching. Um, I will see you on the campaign map before we end the video, I guess. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the battle. That's quite decent. Uh, we just draw the room to us. I think they would have done a whole lot better if they just waited in the fort. Although, I possibly would have burned down the fort in a crisp in that way. But, for now, we're just going to try and kill off the last... Um, <coughs> The last cavalry units, I guess. Uh, you though, you can actually go after uh, these guys for now. But anyway, I will see you on the campaign map for the results. Well, here we are. We lost like one unit and around 600 men, so definitely not bad. Uh, I think we're just going to kill all the captives and uh, mostly kill off all their men. And now we can go back and we're going to take this settlement. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'll just bring him over here, just for the fun of it. I know one thing, I ha cannot be inside the settlement, actually. Uh, yeah, we are actually... There's not actually... Yeah, no, we don't need the money, actually. Just going to do it for the normal. No, no, you're going to get out of it, thank you. Because uh, I'm not going to take the risk that you will die off because of it. So let's just raise an army that can like sit inside of this. Yeah, but these guys as well. I have no idea why. But I don't mind. We're just going to get them. Make sure that he can uh, uh, stay alive. So yeah, we have now taken Knoop or Bats or something like that. I don't know how you want to pronounce that. Just destroy all of it. So you have... Uh, some free space to build, I guess. Um, over here we're building up. Anthony is in the next turn totally replenished and able to come down here as well to help us out with the fighting in this province. Or at least helping out in the patrolling of it. Who knows? Uh, still an army left, the bastard. Still an army left. 
Well, there's a good chance we're going to have like another battle, but I just know right now at least we don't have to. We at least have two armies outside. It means at least they they cannot attack us again. So. Ooh. Um, what can we also get? Morale against barbarian tribes. No, that you need that, but let's just get uh, this one. Oh, you can march so freaking far. I'm not even sure if that's actually your legion. Ah oh, well. Um, I think for now we're going to end the episode here, everybody. Um, if you think I deserve a like or a sub, it's obviously be appreciated. And if you also want to again, take a look at the faction vote in the description below to vote for your faction, it always is appreciated as well, so I can see what you guys want to see, of course. And of course, chose for your faction. Uh, anyway, thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope to see you on the next one. Bye-bye, have a great day.